Okay, in this video uh, I'm going to show you uh, one of the new filters called the Relative Time Filter. Really useful and uh, should be of benefit to you. So if we find a file of interest, so I'll uh, just go to this one here, you'll notice now that there's these little um, like clock icons here. Um, you can open up old cases that have been uh, processed in older versions of Axiom. Um, you don't need to have them processed in the newer version, although I would advise if you can to process in the newer version. But anyway, if you now click on uh, this one of these here, so I'm going to go on the file created time, so I'll click on there. So now I can set a relative time, and what this means is I can set um, some time period. Uh, before or after the file creation time because that's what we've picked so if I wanted to now look at items or artifacts that had a timestamp of five minutes before and five minutes after might be useful to see what the uh, activity of the computer was to uh, up to a certain point I'll just put the range of five minutes in here so it's five minutes before five minutes after click OK and then these are the artifacts now that uh, have occurred between that time period and what you can do then is if you just click on the results up here you can see that this is highlighted uh, and then we can begin to sort them so then we can get a, uh, a bit of a better view now of, of what was happening before and after so here's the file of interest and then we can see what was happening before the file was created and then uh, what was occurring after the file was created so again really useful uh, filter hope it helps and uh, over to you